Yeah, yeah, right on. Go on, man. Looks good. Yeah. Looks yeah. good. Yeah. Come on, Frank. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, Frank. Come on, Frank. You know, we've been hunting here how long? 25 years. Yeah, but they've been some really good hunts. Oh, we've had some good ones. I don't know when we first discovered it, but it was a slow morning, weren't having much luck, and Tim here pulls out some Missouri Lottery Scratchers tickets and starts scratching. Next thing you know, out of nowhere, 14 point buck comes walking up at us. He was a beaut now. So we didn't actually make the connection until the next year when Mike brought some more Missouri Lottery Scratchers tickets to the hunt. That's right. So there we were. We were sitting in our stand. Scratching away. And a whole herd of deer walk up to the stand. Run up! <laughs> That's right. They did come running. And, you know, at that point, we didn't know if it was the sound. Or the scent. But that's right. But, you know, these Scratchers, they sure do bring in the big bucks. You remember that, uh, that year your brother-in-law? <laughs> You mean the guy from Topeka? Oh yeah, that's the one. Mike here brings his brother-in-law for a hunt in Missouri. And he brought those Kansas lottery tickets. Well, see, he heard me talking about these Missouri Scratchers tickets, and he thought he would win some big bucks the same way. Those Kansas lottery tickets don't bring in the big bucks? No. No, all they bring in are these really ugly bird-like creatures. <laughs> You mean the ones that really Whoa, smell? Oh, they stink to high heaven. <laughs> Missouri lottery tickets are the only ones that bring in the big bucks. And we will not hunt without them. That's for sure. Hey guys, I wonder how they work with bass. Hey, I just want $10,000. Don't waste them. That better not be the last one. But, but, but it, it's $10,000.